Oh, oh no. <laughs> Hey everybody. Fat Bird Finds here. I'm Mary Beth. And I'm Laura. Laura, we've got more auction stuff to go through. <laughs> There's so much more. There's so much more. <laughs> I swear it keeps multiplying in there. I know. So, we are going to go through a few more boxes today, show you some cool stuff. Mm -hmm. So before we go and grab a box over here, I'm going to insert some B-roll um, of some stuff that we got for Joy, for Layman's. Oh yeah, those cups are really cool. Yes, so we got these really awesome silver um, wine glasses. Well, they're not glasses. They're like wine cups, goblets. Goblets, I guess you would say. And like these really cool footed mugs. Yeah, I've never seen that style before in silver plate like that. How awesome were those? <laughs> they were so cool. Yes, so we did pick those up at the auction. Those were $61. Joy wanted those, so we promptly took those to Layman's. We don't have them right here. We took them to Layman's as soon as we as soon as we picked them up. Mm -hmm. She was really excited. Yeah, she was super excited. But that's the only thing really that she got. Yes, that's correct. We okay. traded her a couple of things. Yeah, we did. That's right. <laughs> so we are going to grab our first box and jump into it. Okay, so box number one. Mm -hmm. This was kind of an uh oh on my part. <laughs> I think it's funny. So I was. I was in charge of bidding on this auction. If you've missed any of our previous videos, I was in charge of, of the bidding because Laura was at work. Mm -hmm. So I had never bid using this online auction platform before. And so when I first logged on, the auction had already begun and I wanted to kind of like test drive the max bid option. There's a, an option <laughs> like your max bid that you'll put in there. And so I did it on this box of junk, which, I knew it was going to be junk, but I wanted to test the, the max bid option, and I put in, I think, $12, and we ended up purchasing this accidentally for $11.50. Yeah, and I just keep giggling about it because I, that's what's so funny, I think, about auctions. We paid $4 for that huge box of tins, and we had that little pop-up tin live sale mm -hmm. and sold a bunch of them right? and made it you know, made a really good profit. And now we've paid 11.50, it was like three times as much for this box, which we might not sell anything. <laughs> exactly. So I really don't know what all's in here. I do think it's pretty much garbage, but in the spirit of showing everything, even the uh-ohs, we wanted to go ahead and open it. Full disclosure. Full disclosure. It's part of the fun. Hey, we got some packing out of it. <laughs> you probably won't use that. You're like the expert packer. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh boy. Wait, this might be. <laughs> it's hazardous. Okay. Well, here's a little mug. A friend knows how to make you smile. And it's a Hallmark mug and it's just got some little critters on it. It's like a little hedgehog and a koala. Oh, I like that. Look, there's a little fox. That's cute. Good job, Mary. <laughs> here's a mug that says teacher. <laughs> Ah. Yeah, this is not my finest moment. No, I was telling Mary Beth that I can't get that out of there. <laughs> I was watching this really interesting video that Danny Ackerman, the niche lady, did, mm -hmm. and she was she was um, bidding at a really nice. Um, online auction mm -hmm. and she got the shells and they were worth like $800 <laughs> what I know she was looking them up on she was teaching us how to look them up on eBay and some of them were worth like seven eight hundred dollars and I was like well maybe that's what these are I don't think so I don't I don't think they are I mean I don't know anything about shells whoa they're pretty but, but you know those are pretty Here's a oh, candle. Wait. There's still more shells. Do all the shells. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. That one looks like it's been through a lot. Mm, he's kind of, uh-oh. You think? I don't know what I'm listening for. I didn't, aren't you Can you hear the ocean? No. <laughs> this one's kind of pretty. That one is. Is it? <laughs> okay, now what? Look at this big candle. That's impressive. It's like a hunt scene. 
Yikes. It's like a boar and hunters and dogs. That's graphic. That is graphic. I'll show a close-up of that. But that is, that's really something. So I think all the rest of these are candle holders. There's one more candle. Okay. But then... Okay. <laughs> hey, that's marked Japan on the bottom. So there's a pair of those. A parrot? Oh, a pair. These are marked Japan. They're just like ceramic, maybe. Yes, and these are too. So I don't know. Those, those aren't bad. Those are kind of cool. You can go to Bath and Body and get your nice candles that you like to burn in the house. And this, I mean, it's kind of like, instead of, I don't know. Yeah, so all these <laughs> I'm candles. I'm trying to make these sound better than, than they are, maybe, but all they're kind of cute. All these candle holders are marked Japan on the bottom. Was that it? There's one more. It's oh. the same. And then there's this. Oh, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's some sort of geode. <laughs> oh, that's weird. That's really strange. Is it like a scene? Like a... Yeah, so it's like, like some with the sort moon? of... moon? I don't... It's wax. This is wax. I think it's made to look like a geode. But look, I can impression that with my fingernail. That is wax, and there's a candle in the top. That's the weirdest thing I've ever seen in my life. But, like, is that supposed to be a scene? Yeah. I guess. Like, some, like a moon? Yeah, I don't know. You tell or us. Or is it just an accident? You tell us in the comments That's below. That's really something. Laura, I would like to officially apologize <laughs> for this. This is delightful to me. $11.50. <laughs> this was my This is great. finest moment. This is so great. Okay, don't don't judge us on this haul. We've got more. Okay, box number 2. Here we are. This Look. is this is more our jam right here. Yes. So right here on the top, we've got this really cool pink and red afghan. Mary Beth, I'm going to be mad if we open these up and they got holes all in them. Well. Because this is all we could see from the picture. Is that's this true. Pink, this little pink crochet. It's looking pretty good. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, I think that's in pretty good shape. That's a cute one. That is a cute one. I like pink and red together. Yeah, I never really thought that I would have, but. Okay, we don't need to look at these. These are just like. Mattress pads. Yep. Don't need that. Here is a, like a lavender-ish, lilac-ish purple one. Is it? Is it? Periwinkle? I would say periwinkle. <laughs> it's kind of a purpley blue. I it's like just, that. It's just plain, but. Maybe Max needs this. Maybe. Like at my house, like in the floor to play with or something. There you go. Play on. That's a good that one. That one's pretty. Look, there's no holes or anything in that. Yeah. That's a good one. Hmm. This is interesting. Mm. This looks like somebody was just <laughs> using their yarn that they had left over, maybe. Yeah, this is what you call a lap throw, right? Yeah, I think so. I don't know about that one. Nah. <laughs> that one probably needs to go over here. Okay. This one looks promising, maybe. That's like a, that's like a dreamsicle. <laughs> that's like a dreamsicle color. That one's not bad. You like him? Yeah, it needs, I think that there might be a few stains on it. It might need to see if we can clean it. Oh, OxyClean. OxyClean. It's a good size though. Look how long that is. Oh yeah. I'm feeling it. <laughs> I'm thinking. Oh good. I like this one. I'm thinking that one's pretty good. I can't wait to get these spread out to see. I know. But yeah, I like this one. I love the colors. Cool. And I always like the zigzags. The zigzags they're, and the granny squares are my favorite. They're the best, right? I think that these, look. Oh, this lady has a note in this. Look, it's little pot holders, like you make on your little looms. Those are cute. Do you ever do that at camp? No, mm. I never went to camp. Really? Mm -mm. This says used to drain tomatoes. For chow, for chow chow. For chow chow. Oh. September 03, and they put the dates, bless their hearts. Why would you keep up with something like that? Oh, this one looks like, this looks like the one that was really used for that. Oh, right? wow. Look, they've got their strings in here and everything. Yeah, that's perfect for that, for draining. That's awesome. I love that there's a note in there with it. I know. Look how nicely they have that. 
Look, this one looks like it was really used for tomatoes, but maybe not. Maybe it's a pattern. Oh, yeah, maybe. Hmm. That says something, Mary Beth. Does it? Is it inside out? Yes. Oh. Fascinating. <laughs> what is it? Is it a pillowcase? Did that have a note? Full OPEP calf meal. Ha! Uh -huh. It's a feed sack. It's a feed sack. That's what I was hoping. Full OPEP calf meal. <laughs> That's cute. That's really cute. Is that a little cow at the top? Maybe. It's hard. It's so faded. It's hard to tell. But that's cool. We could put that in a linen sale. And then just these little goodies. Oh, yeah. Okay, guys. So this box with the three afghans and the little cheesecloths and those things. How much did we pay for this? $12.50, right? Right. $12.50 for this box. So that was a little bit better. We're, yeah. We're getting better. Each box is getting better. <laughs> That's right. Well, you don't know when you're bidding. I don't know. That's just the fun of it, right? You don't know when you're bidding on each box that you're going to pay, have to pay more for the next one or less for the next one, and it's better. That's true. Sometimes it doesn't make any sense. That's true. Okay. The better things are coming up, so if you're still with us, make sure you hit that like button. Leave us a comment below. Let us know what your favorite thing has been so far, and then you can leave us another comment at the end of the video. <laughs> Let us know what your favorite thing overall was. And make sure you're subscribed if you're not already. <laughs> so, Laura, I think I forgot to say at the beginning of the video, anything you ever see in any of our videos is always for sale. That's right. So. Almost anything. Almost anything. <laughs> almost anything that we show, <laughs> unless we tell you otherwise. But if you ever see anything in any of our videos, or if you see anything in this video that you're interested in, you can send us an email, fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. We will shoot you back a price, and you can purchase from us that way. Yep, it's the best way to get what you want. It is. Okay, so forgot to say that at the beginning, so I'm going to say it now, and then we're going to move on to this little bitty lot. Laura really wanted this lot. Yes. We, we may have paid up a little bit for it, but she really wanted it. I thought it was nice. You paid up for it for me because you paid over what I said because I liked it so much. I kept saying, oh, yeah, those cute little prints. I want those. Yes. But we also, they were like hidden with some ugly pictures, uglier pictures, I guess. Mm -hmm. And some were cute. And then, um, so I think that they were just like a little treasure that people didn't know was in there. But $26 is what we paid. Did this come with a couple larger pictures that we took to Lehman's? Yeah, there was a couple of larger pictures and there was another envelope of like collector kind of prints. Yeah. Um, the Those Lionel Barrymore ones or right. whatever that it's more of a layman's thing to sell. Right. Because they'd be hard to ship. They were kind of big. Right. So we took those smaller um, prints, collectible prints, and those larger prints with the frames. We took those to layman's to oh, sell. Oh, yeah. There was that. Remember, there was that one that had that really pretty antique frame. Yeah, that's really true. Really old frame. Yes. So we traded mom some stuff. Right. That you guys can see later. But Right. <laughs> so for that stuff that we took to layman's and for this little box of prints, how much was that lot? $26. $26. All right, let's see the pictures. Okay, they're so sweet. And I think Patrick may have had some of these on his sale recently. But so they're like, the this is like Northern Paper Mills. Mm -hmm. So I think that they were, oh, look. Re, what's that say? Reordered four sets, November 21st, 1959. 1959. But, you know, I think that they were advertising, like, toilet tissue or something oh I don't know I, th I think that's what it is but oh my gosh look how sweet those are how could you not love those yeah and it looks like I mean they were just kept in this little box for their lifetime yeah this is the box that came in how oh, sweet look at her yeah those are really cute here you can put the tissue in between them okay Oh, look, there's what I looked like as a kid. Is that what you looked like? Wow. Isn't that cute? Dang. <laughs> Is that you? It might be. Wow. 
I want to see a picture of you looking like that. I know, right? I wish I could find one and then we could like substitute it and I mean, substitute it. Put it in the shot there with it. it would, <laughs> you wouldn't be able to tell the difference. Oh, look, this one's got a cat. Isn't he sweet? He's got a little kitten. I think it's a girl. Oh, it is a girl. Isn't she pretty? Oh, I like each one better than the first one. No. Oh. Look at this baby. Oh, I didn't realize there were this many in there. Okay, so that must have been, this says set number two, so this must be set number one. Okay. Oh, that's so sweet. Set number two. Oh, are they gonna be the same? So oh, we can sell maybe. Two, two sets. Maybe so. Yeah, because the original note says reordered four sets. Are there four sets in there? Oh, here's the little girl. Look how 70s she is. Yeah, so we've got maybe... With the green. Hey, I can keep a set and sell a set. We've potentially got a couple sets here. There's that baby again. Mm-hmm. And let's see what the last one is. Okay. Is she, was she in the first set? Yeah. Okay. Looks like we've got two sets of this. Yep. All right. Oh, I love these. We had more than we thought. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. This has five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And in fantastic condition. Very. Okay, great. Why don't you put that piece of tissue paper there? Okay. All right, guys, so if you're interested in any prints, let us know, and we're gonna move on to the last lot of this video. Those are way cuter than I thought. Okay, so for our last little auction lot of the day, we have these donkeys. I wonder who liked these. It was me. <laughs> I think I bid more on these also than, than Laura told me to. <laughs> but they were so darn cute, I couldn't, I couldn't stop. They're pretty cute. You love a good donkey. I do. So <laughs> this one is pulling his little cart. I'll show close-ups of them. You don't have to do that. Okay. But he's pulling his little cart and he's got a little salt and pepper barrel and a cream and sugar barrel. Yeah, so it's like a, you know, a five-piece condiment set. <laughs> it's so cute and look at him. I know. Oh my gosh. Isn't he's, he sweet? He's adorable. Oh, he's doing his best. He's trying, his little he's trying so hard. He's like Ruth Ann. He really is. He's doing his best. He's doing his best. That's all anybody can ask for. I don't, is he marked? Oh yeah, what's his sticker say? Yeah, Victoria Ceramics Japan. Cute. Oh, he's so cute. I can't I like how he's green and marbled kind of. That's, that's pretty. I can't deal with it. <laughs> then there's this guy. <laughs> There's this guy <laughs> sitting in his wagon with his donkey. And he is a, like a decanter. A decanter. Thank you. And he's redware, right? Yes. Definitely. And, and he's a decanter. I... And this donkey <laughs> is pulling a cart of little shot glasses. <laughs> Laura! <laughs> This is so funny. I don't even know what to do with this. I am scared of what you would drink out of these. Like, what the heck? Yeah, I don't know. Tequila. I guess tequila. It's some kind of, <laughs> I don't know, homemade crazy tequila. But there he is in his little sombrero. The top of his sombrero comes off. I, I, I just can't. Maybe we should do shots on flipping and sipping with the little... <laughs> With the little donkey cart. Maybe, but yeah, this is Red Wear, and this, I just, I just can't. <laughs> I just can't even. I can't stop laughing about that. So we found this little guy on eBay, comps in about the $25 area. We've not found him yet, but it'll be, it'll be more than $25 for him. We just haven't decided on a price yet. But if you're interested, you can email us and we'll work something out. <laughs> but I just can't even deal with how cute he He's is. He's really something. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so guys, make sure you leave us a comment below. Let us know what your favorite item of the day was. Don't forget to send us an email, fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. If you're interested in anything, we'll shoot you back a price, and we would love to sell with you that way. 
Yeah, this is like not my favorite stuff, but it's pretty cute. It's pretty good. <laughs> and don't worry, there's more to come. There's still more auction stuff in there. We've got at least two more videos, maybe more. Yes. At least two. And still lots of really good stuff. Probably more. A whole box of salt and pepper shakers. A whole box of salt and pepper. That's gonna be, <laughs> that's gonna be a lot. So just a heads up everybody, we are having a sale tonight with Stephanie at Thrifting Adventures. Um, at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. So that's tonight on Stephanie's channel, Thrifting Adventures. You won't wanna miss it. We've got our stuff set up behind us that we're gonna be selling and it's gonna be great. Yep, seven Central, eight Eastern. Seven Central, eight Eastern, something Pacific. You guys can figure that out. <laughs> on Stephanie's channel. On Stephanie's channel, Thrifting Adventures. So guys, make sure you give us a like, subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and make sure you stay tuned to see what Fatbird finds next. See you next time. Bye, everybody.